first thing? The very first one was Mr. Mapua Business, um, which was in 2013. And I won that. You won. Yeah, I won. And then, I mean, second my one. recent one was uh, August, like first week of August, Mr. World Philippines USA at 2019. Oh, okay. You won again. I won again. In the and international? Then, International? Ah, you know, like uh, in USA, only LA. And then you represented USA where? Not yet. So I was supposed to represent USA in Mr. World. Uh -huh. but since plans changed, I joined Global Asian Models. Oh. That's when I won Mad Hunt Philippines. So you weren't able to represent the US in the Mr. World? No. no. Oh, okay. Oh, and then what's the third? The third was, you know, Mad Hunt Philippines. Global, Taiwan, yeah. Global and models. then. The Manhunt Philippines. Yes. Uh, Dom, how excited are you? Sabi mo kanina, you ready kang ano, tumalno ng ano? Aeroplane. Yeah. Aeroplane. I'm so excited because all my preparations has come to, uh, you know, all the diet, the training, uh -huh. the, the gym, all that comes down to February 22. So it's, hopefully it all pays, pays off in the end. Birthday ko pa yun. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Dom, how, how are you, like, well, of course, fortunately, you're not uh, from China because, as mm -hmm. Roscoe said earlier, the, a representative from China won't be able to join. You, how are you affected by the virus? That's you know. Um. Well, do you have it's friends? It's very unfortunate that China and the other people from that continent is will not be able to go because I would have. I was looking forward to meeting everyone. Mm -hmm. Um, but for me, it hasn't really affected me. I just go along with my day, um, not really scared. Uh, a lot of people, it's, it's sad because a lot of people are scared of Chinese nowadays because, you know, stereotypes that they probably have coronavirus. But for me, I, I don't think like that, you know. It's just normal people like us. They just want to survive and live their lives. Not everyone. Yeah. It's in, it's not everyone. Not yeah, everyone. Not, exactly. Yeah. Uh, how are you... Uh, on a different note, how are you uh, affected by the 36 candidates that you'll be, you know, up against on the finals? <laughs> well, after seeing their photos, a lot of them have way better body than me. They're like super, super muscles. They've been in this industry for like years and years. While I've only been modeling since last year, so they have a lot more experience than me. More physical, you know, attraction. But for me, what's gonna make us stand out is my. Na meet mo na ibang candidates. May na meet ka ng candidates. Not yet, but I've been talking to them uh, through Facebook, uh, also through Instagram, and um, I've added them on Facebook. And so we've been chatting, trying to plan already what we're gonna do, what we're gonna talk about. So you are going to meet them when? On the 18th? On the 18th, yeah, Monday. Monday. Don, sub based on mga photos, kanino ka medyo kinakabahan? Um, medyo kinakabahan, um, based on all the posts that have been tagged yes. on, um, Brazil. Oh. Everyone's been, Always Brazil. Everyone's been like making the top pick. Of, of each competition. The Latinos are always... Yes. Uh, one, always one person different. also stands out for me is uh, Puerto Rico. He mm. looks really Latino, handsome. Another yeah. Latino. Really, really... Yeah, Latinos are dominating right now. So it's, I'm excited to see them. Diba, uh, you studied in the U.S.? Uh, for college, yes. How long were you in the States? I was in the States for six years. I kept on shifting courses until I finally decided I want to take aviation administration. That's, that why, that's why you speak... Fluent English. Yes, that's where the accent come from, came from. But uh, English in general was from Sandville International School, where we spoke English for uh, from grade one until fourth year high school. Oh yeah. yeah. Where is out there? Um, the international school. International school. That's where my mom wanted me to go. Where is it? In it's in Paranaque. Paranaque. Yeah. yeah. BF Homes. BF you Which? are six foot. Yes. <laughs> I don't know are where it came from. Is everyone tall in the family? No, or I'm actually the tallest one in my family. Every Your dad family. is how tall? I think he's like 5'9", five 5'10". Five oh like where did you get your height? Well, it could be from... Because when I was a kid, my mom gave me cherry fur. A cherry fur. Non-stop. Oh, so that's true. So, that's so, yes. yeah. Yeah. so yeah. totoo pala ang cherry fur. Non-stop. Every morning before I go to school, she makes me milk and then puts chair for her. You have siblings, ba? I do have two brothers. In Are they school. tall also? They're still seven years old, so it's hard to tell. Not cherry for din sila. Yes, my mom also gives them. Oh, so, what are your sports? 
Oh, mainly basketball. Yeah. I'm a very athletic guy. Yeah. Six sport. <laughs> you should be doing basketball. Right. I'm a very athletic guy, so I can play any sports, but my favorite sports are basketball, uh, volleyball, even dodgeball. It's not a sport, but I so love Any dodgeball. contact sport. Yeah, contact sport. I love it. My girlfriend, ka, Dom. No. When was no, the last time? This my career first. But you had one before. I had a couple before, but in um, you know. the States, you had. Yeah, a lot. some in the States, some in the You Philippines. dated a lot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so it's, more, it's, I mean, so who's hello. your crush here in the Philippines? Crush? In showbiz. Like celebrity crush? Yeah, celebrity yeah. crush. Well, well, I mean, prettiest uh, for me right now is Catriona uh, Gray. She's everywhere. Oh, so miss you. Right. If you oh win, it's not just Mr. Pretty, Man, also uh, intelligent and uh, so you should outside. you should win the pageant. So what so do you think is your edge over the thirty six candidates? <laughs> yes. I'm an edge. Is, uh, my personality. I'm very approachable, mm. outgoing, very outspo- outspoken. I am very genuine. I will show you who I am. Mm. I will not try to be someone who I'm not. I hate being that. Mm. I hate being someone so who's fake. You're authentic. You yes. are Dom, raw sincere. as it gets. Raw? Very raw. Dom, how are you in dealing with gays? In Well, in modeling, there are millions of gay people. How are you in modeling? How do you treat me? The LGBT. I, I have a lot of cousins that are gay and lesbians. Oh. And, you know, I, don't, I never saw it as like a, something that really like, bothered me or anything. What about Especially gay admirers? Gay admirers, Dom, I'm sure you have. How do you deal with them? Oh, yes, a lot of them are very persistent. I, I just like? Kind of like <laughs> How persistent? In social media. Yes, yes and proposals. Pro- yeah. Really, what's the most, uh, uh, you know, what's shocking? What's the most expensive? Oh, my gosh. Is what's the most expensive? Put out uh, uh, yeah, most expensive? it is. Uh, <laughs> Unless you yeah, accepted I'm it, you did not, right? right? Okay, what was the most extravagant oh gosh, was offer? Time, this person offered 100000 Wow. Lang. One hour. Lang. Do you know you know get the guy or random person? In dollars or random person. <laughs> so what did you what did you what did you tell him? I just didn't respond. Like you know, I just like delete the messages. Dead money. If I respond to them, they're just gonna keep on going. They're yeah. Gonna keep yeah. Annoying me, so. They might think they're interested. Yeah. You should have responded only. <laughs> <laughs> But it should be uh, you, either you or uh, <laughs> right. I'll just backtrack a little during the pageant, the finals of Glam. Were you aspiring really to win the manhunt, or you wanted to win what Joshua I wa- won? I wanted the uh, the main title. Yes. Um, but I'm still very happy to have won manhunt. Um, manhunt is a very big pageant. So I'm very honored to uh, represent the Philippines for Manhunt International. And it's Manhunt has been Manhunt for, on for many been, years. Yes, it's, it's the longest yeah. pageant, so yeah. a lot of pressure. So it's yeah. actually one of the main titles, yeah. really. So you don't hate Joshua? No, I'm just kidding. No time to hate yeah. you. So what are your preparations? Yes. My preparations? For the, for the pageant. Uh, my preparations for the, the pageant? Oh my gosh. Gym every day. And the worst of all, diet. Oh What's, do you have any special diet? Right now, just no rice. Uh, you know, us Filipinos, we love rice, and now I can't even eat it. <laughs> so I miss rice. Oh. No sweets, you know, no chocolate, ice cream, all that stuff. But normally, you eat those. Yes, normally. So only now. <laughs> so after the pageant. Even I'm going to continue those. Just uh, in more controlled manner. Discipline. Right? Mm. And then also hang out with my friends. They always invite me to drinking, you know, all that stuff. But unfortunately, I had to say no to no them. Liquor. So I, bad. I hope they will think of me as like you know less of a friend. But after manhood, hopefully, I have more time to spend time. Uh, Balik ko lang ulit. Have you met Katayona in person? No, never oh, not yet. yet, not yet. Okay. <laughs> and earlier, you mentioned that you'd be escorting the binibining Pilipi- uh, no, the Miss Universe. Universe. Miss Sorry, iba na pala yon. The Miss February. Universe. Uh, candidates. Yeah, How do you feel about that? Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited to see uh, my win. You know, you never know. It's one of those girls. So I'm so excited to see it. So, Dom, um, how do you manage your time now? Because you have a lot of engagements. Uh, how do you manage your time? How do you um, schedule your day-to-day activities? Yes, yeah, I've been so new to this. You know, before I've only been um, scheduling my time like on the spot, but now I really have to plan everything uh, down to the nearest um, minute or hour. I've, 
in my calendar, it has to be very precise on what I'm doing. The day after that, every time someone makes plans with me, I have to ask them when, what time, you know, um, they have they need to let me know two weeks before. It's, it's, it's very hectic. Do you still go to school? Crazy, huh? Do you still go to school? I'm planning to go to school. I want to take like flying lessons uh -huh. from a pilot, but we'll see how my showbiz career. But you already finished one degree. Yes. What? Uh, of course. What? Aviation administration. Oh. Yeah, San Monica College. You don't have a day job as no, of now. No, not right now. So you focus on. Oh. Uh, but you still go to rest. Uh, after your hectic uh, schedule, do you still get to rest? Yeah, of course. I, I still need to get eight hours of rest uh, every day. Um, but you know, sometimes you can't avoid it. You'll have only four hours. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, I try to yeah. balance it all. Out. So where will you go after the pageant? No, Let's say you did not win. Where uh, will you go? <laughs> well, I'll still be doing me. I'll still be gymming, all that stuff. Because you know, even if I don't win that, I still have a lot of plans. In showbiz mm. after Mata. Ah, so, so you it want to stop. get into showbiz? Yes, it doesn't stop. Mm. Ah, so you want do you want to be an actor? Yes, I'm taking uh, acting workshops, mm -hmm. hosting workshops, um, and commercial workshops. Who's your favorite actor? Favorite actor here in the Philippines or in here the world? in the Philippines? In the Philippines, uh, probably Alan Richard. He's the one that really stood mm. out. His acting really stood out. For me. In the whole world. In the whole world, oh, Leonardo DiCaprio. Oh, yeah. Leo. Yeah. If you win, the next day upon waking up, what is the first thing you're going to do? <laughs> if you win, you're going to eat? Oh my gosh! Eat, eat ten eat burgers. Eat. Eat. All the food I've been wanting to eat. I'm gonna go out with my friends. You know, just go all out. Take out. That's good. Right. And then the next day, recover. The next day after that, mm -hmm. back to work. You know, just that simple. <laughs> what are the prices when you win? Hindi pa hindi pa nila sinasabi. The ring. Yung pala sinabi yung ring. The ring, yes. The ring, the ring. For this pageant, like, what really motivates you to win this title? What really motivates me to win this title is to show my parents that I am, you know, I am more than just normal. I'm extraordinary. And also, um, to other people out there, you know, growing up, I didn't, I just thought, you know, parents we raise us, thinking just go to college, get a job, get a family, and then that's the end of it. But for me, I want it's more than that. I want more than that. I want, just, I want to be able to influence people, change their lives, and inspire. And conquer the world. That you're not just good and looks. I'm not just good looks. I'm more than that. So, there is a big pickup line for our viewers, our audience. <laughs> Pick up <laughs> What will you do tomorrow, Valentine's uh, Day? Valentine's Day? Uh, I have no plans on like dating tomorrow. A very busy acting workshop and uh, the oh, Miss that's Universe sad. pageant. Yeah, of that's course. So but, uh, it's fine. Well, you have 86 dates tomorrow. 86 dates? <laughs> well, the candidates will be with you tomorrow. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I mean, if they're, if they're willing, yeah. So this is the first time you will not go on a date in Valentine's Day. Mm -hmm. Walang boyfriend si Catriona, di ba? Di ba? Yeah. Wala. 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 Oh, oh, wala. <laughs> yeah, actually, matagal na nga eh. Mga matagal. Sila ni Clint, parang one year matagal. na. So, interesting. Malay na. 